Why do you think is the reason why Vision can lift Thor's hammer? Vision is one of the most overpowered characters in the whole MCU. With a body made of vibranium and the power of the Mind Stone, he was one of the strongest members of the Avengers. You think I'm a child of Ultra? You're not? Bitch, don't nobody want that weak ass shit! Vision was created by Tony Stark and Bruce Banner in Age of Ultron, when Tony attempted to put a suit of armor around the world. Stark. Daddy? 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 When are we filming, Daddy? What the hell oh, whoa, whoa. is even that? Daddy, chill. However, this led to the creation of Ultron. When Ultron was brought to life, he integrated himself into everything, including the internet, making him nearly immortal. Stop! Yeah, I'm a bad bitch, you can't kill me! But Tony Stark's egotistical personality was also embedded in Ultron, and in turn he sought to prove his superiority over everyone, including his creator by creating his own bioorganic body. And with the help of Dr. Helen, he constructed one that's made entirely of vibranium. But before Ultron could transfer his consciousness into the body, Tony, Bruce, and Thor managed to implant Jarvis into it, giving birth to Vision. I'm alive! I'm alive! Free yourself! <laughs> Initially, the team were unsure if Vision was friend or enemy. So to earn their trust, Vision casually lifts Mjolnir and gives it to Thor, surprising everyone. But we need to go. So the big question is, how was Vision able to lift Mjolnir? Is Vision worthy? Is it because he's a machine? So let's go and explore several possible explanations. Are you ready? Oh, he needs some milk! Yes! Hell yeah! The first possible reason why Vision can lift the hammer is because he's a machine. Even Steve thinks this is the reason. Well, the Vision's artificial intelligence. A machine. So it doesn't count. No, it's not like a person lifting the hammer. Right. However, there are contradictions with this theory, because if machines could lift Mjolnir, why couldn't the truck in the first Thor movie move it? <laughs> Some argue that the truck was controlled by a human, but if we look at the first Avengers movie, when they are in the helicarrier, Thor is not holding the hammer, which means he put it down, but the helicarrier is not falling, which is arguably controlled by humans. Also, I don't think Tony Stark could just command one of his Iron Legion robots to carry Mjolnir. Even though Captain America jokes about whether the elevator is worthy, this theory still lacks a concrete explanation. But if you put the hammer in an elevator, it would still go up. My elevator's not worthy. So let's just move on to other possibilities. The second possible explanation why Vision can lift the hammer is because he is newly born and haven't done anything unworthy yet. The idea is that Vision, like a baby, is pure and has no misdeeds to be judged. However, this doesn't align with Odin's enchantment, which states that whosoever is worthy shall wield the power of Thor, not simply someone who hasn't done anything unworthy. So, this explanation is unlikely. So let's just go to the next possible reason. You are a vain, greedy. Hey, how you doing, love mama? Let me whisper in your ear. Tell you something that you... The third possible explanation why Vision can lift the hammer is because Thor's power make Vision worthy. This is one of the reasons I think is most probably true. When Vision was born, his body was composed of Tony Stark and Bruce Banner's knowledge, Jarvis' consciousness and Thor's lightning. And this is the most important thing, the lightning that Thor fed to Vision's pod. When Stark and Banner were running out of time to wake Vision, Thor helped them finish it earlier by supercharging the pod using his power. Well, the theory goes that because Thor uses his power, some of it was transferred to Vision, and because he now has some of Thor's powers, he was able to trick Mjolnir to think that it was getting lifted by Thor. For me, this theory makes much more sense the more you think about it, since Vision also create a cape similar to Thor's armor. So let's just go to the next possible reason. Maybe I am a monster. For the fourth possible explanation why Vision can lift the hammer is because Vision manipulated Mjolnir's density. This theory revolves around Vision's ability to change the density of himself and anything he touches. This ability allows him to phase through walls and people, and he can fly by reducing his density until he's lighter than air. The theory suggests that when Vision held Mjolnir, he may have used this power to alter its density. 
making it light enough for him to lift. While some argue that Mjolnir's weight isn't the issue, it's Odin's enchantment. Well, don't forget that Vision possesses an Infinity Stone, which could arguably bypass a weak enchantment from a senile old man. What did he say? <laughs> and for the last possible explanation why Vision can lift the hammer is because Mjolnir has his own consciousness. It's alive! The most convincing theory is that Mjolnir is sentient and chooses who can lift him. The hammer seems able to distinguish between worthy beings and everyday objects, like a coat rack, for example. When Thor places Mjolnir on a coat rack, it doesn't destroy the house. Essentially Mjolnir knows that the coat rack isn't a threat or attempting to wield it. So Vision was able to wield the hammer is simply because Mjolnir let him. That's it? And that's it for another episode of our theory yapping. If you have any thoughts or correction that you want to say, feel free to leave a comment and I will read all of them. Thank you for watching, and as always, if you don't like this theory, go f*** yourself.